Big up. Blue tick. Serious banter. People, people, people. You Back don't know. again. You don't Back know the again. Team already. Another week. Back at you. Myself, Bugsy B. Myself, D Godan. Hey, they recognize me as D Godan, you know. Let me just give you a little background story about the name D Godan. So that was the first name that was given to me in my family household. So I'm talking mum, uncles, grandma. You get me? That was my name growing up. Yo, D Godan. So just to make them know what I'm going, you get it? But yeah, now nah, big up yourself. What well, go on? <laughs> Nothing. Hey, you know what? You know what's funny? You mm. see that you're saying that, like mm. that ego thing. Yeah, I was talking to a man. Talking to someone last night. Mm. I don't even know who it was. I can't remember. Mm. But I was saying to them like, yo, this getting recognised thing's getting a bit out of hand. Mm. It's getting a bit out of hand for man. Not still. out of hand still, but it's a, it's a, it's a, it's nice to be recognised for what man's man's built. No, you no, but me? you see, like. Blood, the old me and the new me are still fighting, you get me? Mm. They're still having beef. So, for the old me, that's a lot. Nah, yeah, you get me? Tough. Like, man's in dances, and I'm man are tapping me, and I'm turning around thinking I know people, and I don't, I don't know who the fuck's look. What are you talking about? A man saying, yo, 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 and I'm like, blue tick, and I'm like, oh, yeah, yeah, man's not gonna move to me. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it's real still, car. Man was at an event the other day. And nearly everyone that held man didn't know man, only knew man for the podcast. You get Trust me, I love though. And yeah, like, big up like, for like that, man. you know Trust what? It's, that's love, seriously. Trust and me. next man phoned me and said, Oh, what? You don't check me no more through your podcast has gone global. Come on, I'm man. Saying, I'm saying, blood, I, I, I'm trying to change the circles are rolling. You're not a podcaster. You get it. Podcaster, keep podcaster friend. friend. <laughs> you see me? Come on. Shouts to everyone. Big up everybody, though. Shouts to Blue Rum. Shouts to Quailers. All day, you get I, me? You know what we got to talk about quickly? Go Vic. Shouts to Vic. You see what? You see what? Now He's this, an animal. No, wait. Let me just say something, yeah? Now, regardless of what you think of Vic or whether or not you believe whatever, whatever everyone says about him or what he says, whatever, I'm telling you something. You see what he did on the weekend, yeah? For black businesses, yeah? Straight. The words are coming out of my mouth. It makes him a champion of the village. 100%. 100 and I've always said it. You see if I'm gonna make anyone fly this flag, that one fly village flag, I'm giving it to Vic. It makes uh, what, it serious. Yeah, yeah. What he finish. done was amazing. Like, so he put together a, a, a village showcase um, in the middle of Regent Street. No, don't just, do you see what? You're not Underneath really, you're the not, a man's right, come, not, come, a man's come, not come, really come. selling it to you. Go on. The, the middle of Regent Street sounds like yeah, just the middle of Regent Street. Right, cool, go I on. don't even know what you call this precise piece of Regent Street, but if you know West End, you know the big the big um Sanyo the screen, big Googles, yeah, the there. Sanyo and the Coca-Cola yeah, screens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Directly below that. In a, in a shop space directly yeah. below that yeah. he, he managed to put together and seriously like you had to be there to see it 100% it was beautiful 100% managed... sorry excuse me I need to burp but what yeah what he put together for Fuck black businesses ways. was a may by Vic the champion Big right now I ain't seen... you see what it is you see what a lot of people I'm going to get phone calls for saying that as well a lot of people are going to phone me about this right but what I'm saying is you should have been there on a whole no on a whole yeah on a whole yeah for, pe- for people people who there's, there's, there's two types of people in the world those that talk and those that do innit now when it comes to supporting this village and supporting black people and supporting black movements Vic is one of those that actually does what he, he says he actually he, like regardless if you think he was chatting shit about whatever you see, when it comes to this supporting black people, black businesses, supporting the village, trying to help people, he really does what he says he's going to do. One million percent. Do you understand? Now, it was a lovely event. The people them that were down there, it was very inspiring for everybody. Um, there, was, there, was, there, was, there was children as young as 10 that had their own businesses. There was businesses of all types. Are we, not, are we, not, are we not putting together a vlog? Yeah, we're going to put together we're a video together for a little that, you vlog for you got to see. But it was see actually sick. So shouts to the whole team. Shouts to Aisha, Ashley, Vic. Shouts to everybody down there. You get me? Trust me shouts man. to the woman who won the tree bag so far. Shouts to the woman. Hey, 
Hey, I was waiting for my ticket to come in, you know. And it never come. Hey, you think it's a joke, but yeah, now shout to Still Stitch and Stone. Go yeah. and check them out. Still there Stitch are, and there Stone. are, yeah, there are Beautiful, a furniture a, business. Bes- a black owned bespoke furniture Aye, business. Like family run yeah, thing. A, and it's amazing. Man. They're up against the likes of man like DFS and all of these people and, that's and been in the running for years. Trust me. And they're running a good race. Yeah. Do you get me? So No nah, man, it was mad. Nah. Like, even Blue Rum. Yeah, shouts to Blue Rum. They, they done got, very well they down got, there. They got, they got a couple American clients from yeah, being yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah, get yeah. me? Like, listen to me. Where it was... The footwalk was about 200... Fa- for the whole weekend, it would have been about half a million people that walk past that part where it was. Not saying there was 500,000 people that went into the store, but the people that went in were from the all traffic. different walks of life. Yeah. They're, they're people you wouldn't meet on a normal yeah. day. Yeah, there are people that there are people that our client our clientele circles can't reach mm-hmm. because we're not in their circles to uh, reach right. them. So, Vic, hey, nah, you're not. Usually, man's giving out things for being idiot of the week. Right now, you're champion of the week. Nah, hundred percent. So you have to pick up that yourself. one still. 100%. You get what I'm saying? And more people need to go down there and support the next event. Mm. So if you hear about the village showcase. I have a sign up if you got a business. It's, it's, it's a very good event if you got a business. 100. And if you ain't got a business, just come down there and support everyone. It's 100. Nice. Lovely day. 100%. Shouts to all the businesses down there also. You look all, all, all well. All a man, all, all me, a man who remembers me from Scalibur. Yeah, uh, you get me? <laughs> yeah, that was mad. <laughs> Am I talking about a story saying, yo, you see, a man will go older, brother. I'm telling him my age, you get me? But I'm making him know my age and his age is different age, you get me? So he's saying, boom. Swear my man's got an older brother car. There was a man down there, you get me, look just like my man, but he's chubby. You get me? But I remember he could fight, you get me? And, and one time he had to rear, I'm saying, blood, that was my man. He said, don't lie, rrr. I'm saying, that is the same guy that you fool. Had an older brother, it's him. You get me? Got him on the phone to my man and they were rapping. So, yeah, now, shouts to them. Big up yourselves, man. Then, was... Everything was sick down there. I spent the last three days in West End doing West End stuff and seeing a mad movement that they put together. So now, nah, big them up. You nah, get me? Bruv. Like, people, you, you had to be there, man. You Trust had me. to. I don't even want to carry on about it, but you had to be there. It's just something that you would have had to be there and sin. Yes, mad. So, so the, next one, the next thing we're going to touch on is City Splash. Yeah? Now, I'm not <laughs> sure. I'm not sure because I asked the question, is City Splash the whole Splash? I don't know, you know. Because there's, oh, no right. no there's no more Brixton there. Splash no more. And City Splash is fairly new. Yeah, but so, Brixton Splash used to be on the used to be on the streets, isn't it? Me no know about that. Hey, did Brixton Splash used to be on the roads, like a carnival kind of thing? I don't believe right. so. I think it might have been in a park still. No, nah, man, I'm sure That's Brixton Splash used that. to be. Brixton Splash used to be on the roads, isn't it? We're not from Brixton, so we don't fully know. But hey, what now? You see, City Splash. I heard. Well, I weren't there. But I heard it was an absolute madness. Yeah? Neither so was I. I, I never went. a man and a man says to me, yeah, it's warm, you know. He phoned me, he's like, yo, you're coming down? I'm saying, no, nah, I'm staying away from this splash stuff. But yeah, he says, cool. Right now it's warming and there's three to one. Aye, I'm yeah, even gonna, yeah I'm, it's all like aye. a bookies. Three to one, the man told I'm, me. I'm not even going to lie, yeah? I, I was trying to get my bougie on, innit? Like... Black man's too bougie for every event and rare, rare, Yeah, rare. No, 100% you got to be like that. And then you see when I saw the statuses, yes, I, I was vexed. You want unbougie <laughs> yourself. I get it. <laughs> but you see the odds a man was giving me, like when he told me, yes, yeah, warming, said there's cheetah one, girl, Danny. Well, obviously that's his thing, you get me? See, when I spoke to my man the next day, he's making me know five to one, so them odds there went up. I'm when saying, I, wow, this sounds like a bookies. And no. I said it was a ton of people, you, know you get me? You know what, more people, on my on my social medias were there then then they go carnival. Yeah, I think it was mad. I had more people like I had more it was sta- on everyone's more feet. Is there. Yeah. It was more, on more feet. pictures yeah. and videos of that mm. than I do of Carnival or anything like that. It was every it was on everyone's feed. So obviously us as blue tick we done the inquiring like how was it like who really showed up? Who really done well? Who flew the flag? I heard Skilly Bang was the shittest now, in man, the world. I heard Skilly Bang yeah, was he's dead. a terrible live performer. And yeah? he's a studio man. Now you see this whap, 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 whap stuff. Like, I've got kids in it and all my kids, yeah, that's like one of their first little words that they say. <laughs> like, they just walk around the house and say, whap, 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 whap. He get me. So it was very like, for me personally, he's got some bangers. He's got a couple bangers, but his lyrical content is not the best. And clearly his live performances 
are doo doo. You get me? So the man. The words and that man is waiting for the crowd. The man can't understand these things. Did Chen see show up? No. No Chen. So yeah, she couldn't get her visa in it. Mad. I heard about that. But story. I heard, I heard Skilly Beng weren't guanin really. I heard Chronics. Guanin. He was guanin. You get me? So shouts to them man there. Shouts to the right, whole event. Well, you're not shouting at Skilly Beng. <laughs> nah, Skilly Beng. You just <laughs> airway is. I'm, I'm. I'm not gonna take nothing away from him. He's a fairly new artist that's just stepped out. Yeah. So I just believe he's got more work to he's do. Showmanship. Yeah. There's a lot of man that started doing showmanship from when they were youths, waiting, getting ready for that big day. Do you get me? And I don't mm. think he's a, he's a man that I reckon just fell into music and he just needs to do a little bit of polishing up they when needed, it comes to they this needed, They needed Byron Messiah there. So I'm going to ask da, you a question. Da, what would you say? Da, da. What would you say? Okay, Coffee was there. Shouts Coffee. How did she perform? She weren't bad. Still. She weren't bad. Who's the so best? What? She weren't strong enough. Who's the best performer though? Deneo. Deneo. But, but, big up Deneo. Big up Deneo. Deneo. Well, what's, so what stage was Deneo on? The same stage as Skilly Bang? No. I was on Rampage's stage. Oh, Rampage's stage. Nah, shouts to Cash was there, innit? Hey, Cash was on Skilly's stage. He was on before Skilly. Who Cash was? Mm. Did he mash it up, yeah? I don't agree with him. He done well. He done well. That's family of the show, you know. That's tough. That's family of the show still. That's tough. All right, let me ask you a question. What would you say Skilly Bing failed in? What was his... What would you say he needs to work on? He needs to actually sing the song. So, Skilly, you need to sing the tune. So basically, I'm airing you the same bits and making everyone else. Remember, man, are paying 50, 60, 80 pounds to come in your place. Said, no, you, 50, can't 60, expect, you can't expect them to come and do the work, you know. Yeah. You got know to say, you got to do some work. As well, you, you. you never paid to see You us. understand? So, yeah, yeah no, nah, I won't like it sounded. It sounded like it was mad. I'm not going to lie. From what I saw, it looked cold. <laughs> you, know what I'm to no, you know what I'm mad it was? Yeah. I, I went to Lewisham yesterday and there was no black people in there. Dada, it was nuts. It was well, everyone from everyone. Blood. If you was Listen, black, you was there, I was in Lewisham yesterday and there was barely any everyone black people. Everyone was in City Splash. I was saying to a man, you know how funny it was? I said to, I said, I said to, I said to, I said to him just yesterday, Blood, this feels like a Friday when Scalibur was on. Mad. <laughs> Mad. It's good though, the elders did mix with the youngers. Okay, so that's a good thing. So that's a man a saying thing. there that the elders mix with the youngers, mm. which is always a good and thing. There was, and there was no trouble at the event. And there was thousands. 10, there was no, you never saw no trouble at all. 30, so that's a good thing. That's I'm going to touch really on what you thing. said first, because I always believe that there's a bridge when it comes to the elders and the younger. So you see when they can be in one place and embrace each other. I love that. You get me? Because I believe that we've got a lack of that in our community. So that's a good thing. Shouts out to everyone for that. Also, the fact that there was 30,000 people, OK, and no trouble. That for me is a big thing. That's a first in Brockwell Park. Do you know what I mean? That's a first in And man said park. they used up the whole park, so there was like nine stages apparently. And so every stage then. was going in. So it was really, it was really, it was big, big, big. Big, big. About 40, 50 food stalls. Yeah, big up Cajun, because I heard he was down there chefing up the place. Oh, swear food that. Seller. Swear that. Some year. Yeah, can we page him for some bread in it? Cause he likes doing paging for bread stuff. <laughs> So we got you. You make your thing though. <laughs> <laughs> so now, nah, shouts to the city splash goers. Shouts to the people that we put it on, and shouts to yeah, just yeah. Hopefully the next one will be greater, and hopefully I'll show up. You get me? So um, yeah, man. But other than that. That's it for City Splash, you get me? Can't oh, get them all the rascals. I'm going out. next year, I'm not being bougie. You're not going? I'm but going. I thought you was going, you no, told me. Like, yeah, you actually, I actually thought you was going. You thought I was going to go? Mm, I thought you was going You know what? Still. One second. Z, you see when you see this, you're a pussy hole and you snaked me. I, I'm not even lying, I would have went, yeah, if my, bre my brethren Z never snaked me. So I phoned him. Meaning, meaning probably agreed to go from last week. Like, he's like, well, Monday, season. I said, all right, cool, come we roll, you get me? Boom. He said, yeah, I'm going to sweat tickets, everything, don't watch that. Boom, woke up, woke up, woke up yesterday morning, like, yo, let me phone Z, see what I'm going, you get me? Shouted Z. Z never answered his phone. <laughs> Bad Z. Z. Z never answered his phone. And then, and then boom now. Bad flipping, Z. Flipping. The next thing check, I see, check, check, I see snap of a city splash, you get me? No, what? Oh, what? Z, so Z, Z, Z went? Z was in city nah, splash. Nah, Z, I hey, don't so, know who you are, but so that's what, bad, bad, so bad so behavior. So, 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 so,
simple as simple the, the emoji was simply a snake never need for send on just send you the snake man sent me a ticket and told me come now <laughs> Come yeah, by yourself. Man, that's mad. Yeah, try to find me. Get 30 thousand people. Get up here by yourself. I'm hearing no people. Service. I'm I hearing people. No service, there was no service. So it was like a carnival vibe. And I heard a man lost these bridges for two hours. You have to look at man's Snapchat to know where man is and work it out from the stage. Yeah. So you have to put the stage there and then yeah. say, yo, yeah. let, me see where man's, let me know where man's filming from. That's where I can find man. Now nah, that's good though. And I will say this, at least we showed out in numbers, not for something sad. We always say, when it's something sad, the people them show out in numbers. So at least it was a positive event that went a positive way, you get me? So I rate that. No, it was a good, I heard it was a good day. I can't even say it was a good day. Mm. People mung them with their buggies and that and their youths. Yeah, so no, kids no. were there and that, yeah? Yeah, I see man with their youths on their shoulders and yeah, man's got their youths rocking away. See it, see uh, it. Some no, that's tough still. Drop lion and them. What you so, so what you Deneo, so give me the top three artists that you saw yesterday performing. So we're going for Deneo number one. That's a big shot, Deneo, because you're in there with, with some with some big names. Deneo is a big name. Though. I know this, but you know what I'm talking about. Deneo's from here. I know. But you gotta realize from here, yeah, but man everywhere. Have, yeah, I know, but man have flown in to come and do their performances. Yeah, yeah, cool, cool, cool. You get me? You're gonna have to say chronics and coffee, isn't it? Chronics and coffee. What about cash? And cash. And cash. Big up, Man, everyone. Man, leave out cash-tastic, you know? Nah, 100. And CO5 management oh, to the world. No, Big up all of them. Big up them, man, my peoples. I don't peoples. know her name, but I did catch her thing. She says that um, Afro beat tune. I'm going to find you the tune. Not Rebecca. It's like Azira. Man said not Rebecca. Who, who's like Rebecca? Isaiah. The one that sings, um, Oh no. You won't break my heart. Oh, yeah. yeah no, she, she, if she was there, I would have went. Yeah. If, she was, if her name was on the flat, I would have pulled up. I would have pulled up. A man, a man wanted to drop me there by myself, you know. A man was saying to me, I know you want to go. Look, I'll drop you there now. By your, I'm saying, what, you coming in? He said, no, I'm going to drop you there. <laughs> yeah, you nah, it's mad. Who? Your brother. All right, that's... Mm. Hey, young B. Young B. Young B is there. A man like Young B in the building, you know. <laughs> Big up Young B, innit? Big up Young B, still. Big up Young B. Trust me. It's Young B, Young B, Young B. Yeah, let's move on. What we got to move on to? But yeah, okay. right, cool. Here what we want to touch on, yeah? That's her name, Ira Star. Ira Star. So her thing was tough, yeah? Do you know who he's talking about? No. Huh? No. <laughs> the way you said it, you but said big up Ira Star. Like, like, like I know who you are. Like you were beating that like yesterday. Right. You don't know her tune. <laughs> I don't. How? I don't. I'm not saying I don't know her tune. I, I don't know, know her That's even if we know her tune or not, I ain't gonna change that. But big up Ira Star. Man, yeah, big her up still. Don't really know the but name. What we wanna touch on though? Yeah, we need to touch on this whole people doing mad stuff for views. Yeah. So we're not gonna talk about that. F- I was just about to say something mad on this. Oh, uh, we talk about him after. Gonna, all right, cool. Yeah, we talk about that one later. I was just about to say something. But you see what it is, I was is, just about yeah? to say that something that was going to get our channel striked off. All right, so you see this thing. We have a we have these young youths going around. Uh, everything's for views, yeah? But they have a pranking a man. That Mizzy, is his name Mizzy, yeah? Mizzy. Mizzy. So him and his crew, they go around and they prank people, yeah? Skits. Sorry? Skits. Is Bredgen skits as well. I don't, so they go know, around. I don't even know who skits is. Yeah, so they do some mad pranking. So the one I saw the other day, I saw a clip of him talking to Piers Morgan. Yeah, and Piers is getting on to him, but he's getting back on to Piers. You get yeah, but me? you gotta go. You gotta go past that. You gotta explain where the shoots come from. All right. So this shoots come from the road, as far as I know. Yeah, he's a young youth. Um, TikToker. He's TikToker. He goes around doing mad pranks, but his pranks are not a fun. They like majority of his pranks ain't funny, and you gotta realize now it's not funny. That's other, really getting views. Wait, it's the other day. So he rides into the, the supermarket like Sainsbury's on a Boris bike and rides around the whole team, rides out into the where they store the food on the push bike. Eh? No, but it got, you see all of that, you see all of that. It was all, it, every, I, I know this youth's been doing pranks for a little while. Mm-hmm. You get me? It was, it was all, it weren't, he was brought to line, like thrust into this position because he went into people's house. Yes. Even his brethren walked into yes. the people them's house yes. and had the woman all scared. All can, shook. Uh, had the woman all shook. Say so what now? He's rolling. He's coming with his friends. I think they were coming from school. Talking about yeah. School. And the woman's in the garden and the, the front door's open. It looked like a quite an affluent area. The man's walked into the house and the woman's seen it. 
And she started calling she for says, her husband. She says, James! James is her husband in the yard. Uh, a man <laughs> saying, yeah, James, we need to see you, James. Bad James, James. Get man saying, what, where's the study group? <laughs> yeah. Where's the study group? Now, he walks into the house and James comes up the stairs and sees four little youths. Black youths. In, black youths James in, is in his white, yard. James is an affluent white man. Yes. And James just looks like he just start pooing himself straight away, you get me? But they say to James, James, where's the study room, you get me? Or the study group, you get me? So they're making it seem like they're walking around they walked the into the wrong house and thought it was a study type of thing. They're they walked gone into the man's house and room. sat down on the, the man's room. sofa. Yeah? Now, you see, if you don't know that's a prank from, the, from behind the camera, it's funny. But you see, poor James... Paul James and his woman never knew this was a prank. So they automatically thought they were dead in. You understand me? And the woman just left James. I never saw no footage of her coming behind the use to see if James was all right, you know. She stayed outside. <laughs> you understand? Yeah? I left calling, James. You can see her calling him through the door. <laughs> yeah. James! I left James! James. <laughs> left James to get James. Do you get me? So, for me... I won't lie to you, I can see where the people that are going when it comes to this views thing. And I don't really agree with everything everyone's doing for views. You get me? But it's a danger. Yeah, you know what? You know what? But it's a you dangerous see, situation you see on another to be in. You see, on another day, I'm not even lying. Me in my yard with my youths, and you come in, the first thing I'm doing is, is looking for something to do you over with. Do you understand? And then That's you the can't apologise to that. But I'm saying, even with that being said, yeah. He obviously recognised his thing and he said it like I could have filmed my apology and made another viral moment, but he said it wasn't for that. I actually genuinely apologised. Apologise. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. No, I get that. His kids are unguided, isn't it? He's got no dad. If you see his thing, the second podcast of him and his brethren ain't got no dad. Grow up, really. You know what I mean? So no, I get that. Got no I get that. Yeah? Now that came to life. That came to light because of Pierce Morgan. Yeah, he was on a Pierce Morgan show. I see a clip of it. And Pierce is going at him. Nah. More on like you. Yeah, and more rare, on rare, like rare, you. And rare, rare, rare. I won't lie to you. You see Pierce Morgan. I don't agree with everything he does. But you see as an interviewer, he's sick. Yeah, you draw your act. Yeah, man start talking about you're like, you're like a bozo and no one cares about your colour. It's not about your colour. You're just an idiot, basically. You get me? And he's pulled this shoot out and this shoot starts telling him about, like, who care about your thing? And Are you going to speak over me, though? Are you going to yeah, speak? Are you pissed? Arrogant, no, you're an idiot, man. I'll just do this on your show. <laughs> yeah. Like, it got mad. It got like, a, it got like the playground. So my man said, what did your mum think about this? Man said, man, I don't even chat to me, mum. Still, you get me? <laughs> Like, it's not funny, we should laugh. Funny, yeah? We should laugh. But it's we not laugh. funny. It's not funny. Because mm-hmm. as a man just said behind the camera, you see certain kids that are not guided. You see misguidance or having no guidance is like it will end you up in certain situations. Do you get what I'm trying to say? And even being able to articulate yourself once being in that situation because you're sitting down talking to a man that's been in the business for 30 years interviewing you and it's hard, it's like, it's hard for you to even articulate yourself and be able to explain your side of thing. You get me? Without looking like an idiot. Because when I saw it, he kind of looked like a bit of an idiot when he's trying to explain his song. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Him. What, to come, on, have, the, yeah, they, to come says, on Piers Morgan? Yeah, Piers said he paid him to be here and said that I should have paid my viewers to watch, sit through this and watch this instead of paying him. Okay, so you see with that, even have been you see with that then, that's, no, that's Piers I doing know. stuff for views. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, because if you paid a man to come here, and you know that you're highlighting his fucked up behaviour, yeah, which has got him views, yeah? You're doing things for views as well. Yeah, but every, listen, from you on the internet, you're doing things for views. Yeah, it's but just it's, how it's just how far how you're you go about go, it. It's just how far you're willing to go for views to mm. get these views. You you don't put nothing on the internet to not get views. Yeah, yeah, That's, yeah. But it's how you go it's, about it's, it. And you don't invite a, a, a 16, 15 year old and then rip, rip him, him. Yeah, rip him to shreds. Now, rip what him to I, now what I would ask is, he comes out as a collective, so it's not just him that does stuff. It's him and his brethren. Yeah. Where was his brethren on the interview? His brethren never got nicked. His brethren ain't on the ain't on the arrest video. When he walking in the police station, his brethren's not getting arrested. Okay, it's only miss. You know about his brethren? No, I, I know nothing. I know nothing about so these kids. His brethren is obviously there's two of them in it. Skits and that and you no know, one's he's never been tested to see if he's got mental health and that but like he's the one that's got the use them um punching the wall training their hands mm, like, you're um, actually right about this because he i said me, I, and he's the actual so mrs isn't is done nothing violent mrs is more anti-social you get me yeah. just doing things and being in places you shouldn't be whereas my man's physically going around 
And he used to have my following this, you know? Yeah. Because I, my brethren's son, the other day, phoned my brethren like, hi, I'm moving my wardrobe um, out. So if you come in the house and you hear a lot of noise, what I'm doing, I'm chaining my shins to get strong. And I'm kicking the wall. So I'm moving the wardrobe to kick the wall. My brethren said, make sure you don't hurt yourself because I'm, I'm not taking you no hospital. But these are the things that they used to my seen on so, viral. Wait, 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 wait. Do you phone these dad and said he thinks he's John claude Van Damme? Jo- he said he's learning um, Wing Chun. No, it was, was it Wing Chun? Muay Thai. It was Muay Thai. He said, listen, you see when you're coming and you air noises and that, you don't need to come into my room. I'm going to explain what's going on from that. So my man said, so where have you learned this from? Like, have you been watching things? He said, nah, I'm just learning it from myself. Yeah? <laughs> I'm, I'm teaching me how to do Muay Thai. I started busting up in the car because I'm saying to myself, these shoes are actually nuts. So my man saying, if I, like, I've got strength from my shins and that takes me kicking the wall. And um, basically, like, don't watch the wall in it. If the wall comes down, I saw it go. Yeah? My bridge didn't know what to say, but I'm busting up because to me it just sounds nuts. But these are the things that the kids are seeing on social media. That's why I will say social media is a drug. Yeah? Alcohol, all of these things, you can't take them to a certain age until your brain develops properly. Listen. Kids should not be allowed, bro. Free reign on social media. I right, watching social media releases yes. releases releases, releases releases some endorphins. of the same things endorphins that that you get released from taking it's drugs. Hundred percent. You get from the slot machine. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I think that is actually sick that they're pushing these stuff. So for me, like right, obviously, it's, it's guided by parents, isn't it? But I'm gonna say one thing to parents. Parents, you lot need to evaluate the situation. And if you have a child that's of a certain age that has free reign to social media, I think you need to look into it. Because not even certain parents know how to manage certain social medias. You know what? Now there's people who are posters and there's people who are priors. I'm making you know this. There's a certain type of person who just has social media to pre what everyone else is doing. Facts. Do you understand? Fast. Now that can be dangerous to the individual because it will start making p- making you feel like you're underachieving in life. It's easy to do these stuff, make you feel like you want this and you want that only because of what you're seeing. Do you understand? So that's, that's why most relationships don't work now because there's always a meme for it. Mm. A girl and girls are looking at fake fake relationships and fake relationship goals. Fake pages. They're, they're listen, fake, they're following fake. fake, 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 fake. You're, you're, the goals that you're setting are fake. So how is it going to work? 100. Like, how is it going to work? You expect your man to do this, that, get you a thousand roses, drop you drop you to work, pick you up to work, still have time to work, break bread, pick up the youths, then cook dinner. It's, what, what are you talking about, bro? <laughs> what are you on about? Unrealistic fuckery. Them Instagram, them memes have got you girls tripping. No, 100%. I don't know what, they're like, I don't know what guy really feels like that is the thing, though. When you really think, and that's a mental health issue, you know, for her to sit there and think, she should just be catered on. Let me ask. Let, wait. Hey, let me ask. Let me ask. As a man, as a man, ever had an argument with a girl over Instagram? Over because she's tried to come with some Instagram argument. Fact. Yeah. No, but I know enough men do. I have. I haven't. You're not allowed to like put pictures. In. I have. No, not even that. They've tried to bring to me like what? Read this me. This is it. That's it for you. What, what are you talking about? What? You, what you, this is not real. You're a bad man. I beg you stop snoring in the back there, though. <laughs> You're a bad man. I can hear a, a snoring still, and it's coming to the, to the headphones and that. <laughs> I shall tell you, I know this bed is amazing. The man's sleeping and still holding on to his phone. Yeah? Yeah? The man's got rigor mortis <laughs> while he's sleeping. <laughs> Gangster shit. <laughs> hey. That's just social media. Hey, it's mad. The man's sleeping, holding his phone. So I'm looking now, and I'm saying, he's still on his phone. Man. So did you hear the noise? The noise gave you up, man, man. You get me? But yeah, nah, this social media thing is mad. Like, I won't lie to you. For me, it's like, can you really handle it? Hmm? Can people really handle what goes on on social media? I don't think they can. I let me ask you a question though. Mm. Like, I what race is the most? What not? Don't ask. What 
what sex is the most manipulative? Don't answer. Um. <laughs> Yeah, non-binary. <laughs> no, I'm serious. Be, be, be serious. Um, Do you say men or women? W- women are more manipulative. Now, what they're gonna say is, I think women. Okay, <laughs> but no now I'm a narcissist. Yeah, yeah? Now, that's 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 you what the new thing's gonna be. But I will say this like because. That. There's a lot more for a woman to be, that she can manipulate you with. Yeah? Master manipulators. Like, trust me. Yeah? Like, I've had an argument with a girl to the, uh, before and they've told me, listen, today's Sunday, you know? Like, okay. Huh. Oh. I, I, I thought it was oh, Tuesday. No, it's Sunday today. Basically, I'm not in a rate today. It's a Sunday. Oh, it's the God's day. Oh, but when you want to piss me off on a Sunday, it's all right. But you see the moment, man, when you get me, have a certain conversation, they tell you, hey, it's one o'clock in the morning, you know? Okay, but you phone me. Yeah? It's mad. So, for me personally, I believe. But everyone's going to say that's because I'm a man. Right, can so you that's look, why I say, right, no, it's a non-binary Can you, can you, can you comment on that, please? Because I just want to, I'm trying to do, I'm trying to do a little, what's the word? Poll. Yeah, a little, a little, a little, a little survey. To what see, to see who me. Yeah, what right. do I think? What do you know? I think there's. <laughs> I, <am> I <laughs> no, like that. <laughs> pussy, 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 pussy. I, I know, so I know, no, I, I know. I've been getting manipulated. I tell, I tell you that. <laughs> I tell you that. I know More that. than you've been giving that. <laughs> Just me. Now nah, you see what you see what I think. I think I think women are women are bigger manipulators because that's their biggest tool. Hundred. Like men can be overpowering, dominate, and whatever, whatever. Women have got to be more manipulative about what they're doing, so it's it's it benefits them to be more manipulative. Because sometimes a man can bully his way. A man don't need to manipulate. Hundred. You get what I'm saying? Like, so a man's last line of defense is his fist. Yeah, yeah, violence. Yeah. You get but what I'm saying? Certain man, that's their first line of defense. So they can't chat when they're with their gal. Yeah. You see when like the gal just giving them. The, the G- you know when the girl just giving you her GCSEs? Like uh, oh, brr, brr, and a man ain't got none. He just says, hey, what? Fuck you. <laughs> you get me? Like a girl who chose her own GCSEs, you know? Chelsea and her masters. <laughs> Have that. That's why you ain't got a You ain't got, hey, you ain't got nothing to say, no? Obviously, no. <laughs> So I get it still. <laughs> That's why the man them have to just educate themselves. So, you know hey, what? What do the man them think though? What do the man them think? The most manipulators. Who's master manipulators? It has, it has to be a woman, innit? it? Because we're too, we're too simple, man, and logical. We just think things through A, B, C, and they need no, to... Hey, hey, no, hey, no, hey, don't, a. hey, listen, let me tell you something. Don't fuck with certain man, you know? Certain certain man will manipulate the milk out of coffee. Yeah, I'm just fucking with the black man, coffee you know? still. Yeah, with a, you poured milk in your coffee and you're that's still in like up with a black one. The difference is that's like a difference between a, a Jamaican and a Yardi. <laughs> yes, we have those elements. Like they have uh, girls that aren't as manipulative. Do you get what I mean? I'm just saying, no, oh, listen. Overall, it's there. Brother, even a girl, do you know how nuts it is? Even when a girl puts on a sexy voice to talk to you. That's manipulation. Hundred. That's how mad it is. Girls a girl, you like when a she's cool flattering girl. her hair, when she's talking to you and brushing past your chest and and touch your leg, it's all manipulation, bro. Remember they say, you know, when a girl's playing with her hair or twindling in her hair, you know, that means there's there's signs in it. They are part of. They are manipulative signs. Like yo, pussy. When men manipulative, generally. Come get me. Because we are manipulated, right? Men can definitely be manipulated. No, listen, man manipulate gal to give them pum pum. Man tell gal I, I play for I play for Norwich. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's nice, that's not manipulation. <laughs> <laughs>
I play, I play for Norwich. I'm in the Premier League, but I'm injured. I ain't played for. I ain't played. For, I ain't played for six months because I, I did my. I did my ligaments. I did. I did the main one, the arteria. I did it. I did it. I did it. That's what you. Have to, that's cruciate. The cruciate ligament. Man's telling, man's telling girl I'm injured. Yeah. Nah, it's mad still. But Gallatin, Gallatin is in their only fans and they're this and they're that and they're this, so don't get twisted hey, like No, it. but you see what? Enough girls have got only fans and got no fans. Mm. I don't know. You, you gotta realize, enough, enough girls that go and like, they do this only fans thing, yeah? You're dead, you're not making no bread. No they one. got like an only fan. <laughs> no, they got only a fan. <laughs> <laughs> they got only fan. <laughs> And the man and the, they've got people hacking their thing regular, so I'm just giving away the the, the, the video footage. How do you know that? Because man get them in the group, innit? Regularly. That's mad still. People are doing a lot of stuff like even right now, yeah, you get mad stuff like you find someone trying to log into your page. Right, yeah, you all of these stuff. Have you received a text message that says, Mum or hi, I can't get hold of my phone is broken, yeah? It's me, or mum, it's me, or dad, it's me. My phone is broken. Um, I'm using my friend's phone. Can you message this number? Yeah, you see that text? That's gone. My whole family's had that text, and other families that I know. It's worse than that now. So I believe once you phone that phone, they have they I, can I, they can I, take wait, over wait, your wait, things. I'm just sitting there thinking. Let me say, let, I, what, would you would you do only fans for three bags a week and show your face? No. Would you? Liar. <laughs> this liar. Nah, so. Ryan, would you? I bigs, would you? Only fans for three bags for three bags a week, and you have to show. But you have to you have to dig out the gal and show your face. At thirty bags a month. I'm in. Still. I'm in. <laughs> I'm in. Right, man, you see what? I'm not even. You've gone far. Five bags a week. That's twenty. That's twenty k a month. Man's not in. Man, yeah, man's not in. Yeah, that that one man's is that what man's telling me? Taking, taking a six. Is that what man's telling me? I'm taking a six. I, 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 you see, this is what I mean. The man them ain't real on the podcast, blood. Get the right man. The man them not blood. The man them are doing it for two. Twenty like a man, I'm doing stop. it. Stop. The man them are doing it for two right. and a half bags a week. Man them are not doing it for two. The man them are. Hey, Dan, Dan, you're doing it for ten bags a month. Don't stone lie. You all fucking get it for ten bags a month. What's on camera, like you're like doing it. Money. I prefer doing it for 10 bags a month off camera. <laughs> <laughs> Tell you that. <laughs> if that's an option, I'll take that. <laughs> no, no, because you know what? I was thinking, yeah, I, I swear down, man was talking about the OnlyFans. I'm saying, raw. how much would it cost for me to be on OnlyFans with my gut out? I'm my face and just digging out, just digging out. Cheap bags, you happy with that? Look, cheap bags a week. If I can get, I can save my yard. I don't have to work again. Cheap <laughs> bags a week. Can we just set your price at cheap bags, right? Who? I'm you, not, no, I'm. Not, I, I don't. So you film the content, and in order to see it, you pay you cheap bags, and then they get to see it. And then I'm yeah, I'm not. No, no, so but I'm just saying see this it. is all hypothetical. <laughs> Yeah, this is all hi- this if is not real. Like, this, is, this, is, like, this is like so this is like social media, it's not real. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's like social yeah, media. Yeah, yeah, yeah we, we're yeah, just yeah. talking hypothetically amongst friends. Mm, okay? Mad, mad but stuff. I'm saying, if it, you know what? If your woman showed up tomorrow and said, Look, I'm paying you two and a half grand a week, we're doing our OnlyFans, what are you gonna say? Do I have to give you half of it? No, she's paying you. She said she she's paying you two and a half bags a week. Who the fuck she think this is? <laughs> <laughs> is she alright? Are you caught are you are you stupid? You find out she's just you're just getting you're just getting pulled from everyday he stands in the side of a camera. Hey, cool. hey, 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 what comes hey, hey, what comes hey, hey, what comes hey, what comes with the two and a half grand? All the gallon that she's bringing in to beat, you get to beat with her. Nah, I know a man that overbeat. I know a man that overbeat himself into oblivion the other day. So it's when you get too much, <laughs> sometimes too much ain't good. Yeah, I'll stick with the one. Yeah, but I'm not having my gal send me two and a half quid. Who the fuck do you think I am? You understand? Would you be upset if you find out she was secretly doing it? Like, oh my gosh! Uh, Wait, would I? Would I be? <laughs> Fuck off! Fuck off! Fuck off, man! Fuck off! Hey, I won't do this with this brother. I I won't do this with this brother no more. What is it? He's talking about man got fucked into oblivion. I don't want to do this with this brother. It's real talk, (laughs) and it happens all across the world. (laughs) 
Hey, big up yourself. Yeah. Hey, big up yeah. yourself. Yeah, big up yourself. So I'm saying to man, yeah. Now you see if, now you see if man had a secret, secret camera, yeah, in the room. Yeah. I won't still be, I still won't be able to trust her. <laughs> but you're a liar now. You're see, you're, 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 you understand? Oh, she showed me your secret footage made me fight quick. Uh, uh, hey, let me ask the man. Yeah, I'll take the best footage out of it. Cause it's gonna be nice. You know the nights when man just fall in and drop my cow. There's gonna be nights like that. That's not good content. It only has to be good content. You get me? But I know certain men are gonna be over pissed because. They talk a thing that they, they say, I don't do this and I don't do that. The camera's gonna show everything. <laughs> yeah. Hey, let me ask you. How, how, much, how, much, how much girls do demand them think? Honestly, this is honestly, yeah. Everybody, everybody likes the sound of moresums and moresums and moresums. But honestly, how much girl do demand them think solo dolo them could handle by themselves at once? Now, you see, if you're on Yamans. <laughs> I reckon two's on the cards for you. Cause you got one there and you got one down there. Now you see for me myself. I, yeah, I just want one one. Me, I'm happy with one one, like one one, no, you know one one. We two. I don't want to yeah. that. I love proofing. We're two. You get me? Huh? Obviously the man have done things. Don't get it twisted. But how much but, how much do the man them reckon they can handle today? One one. I don't know, if I've had a Camagra, maybe. A man said a <laughs> Now, this is another thing we got to touch on. The man's talking about... Uh, what's it called? What's it called? Camagra. Now, the man them have been using pills. That's cheating. That's cheating. 100%. Hey, girl, there's enough man out there giving you good work with, with, with enhancements. Let me tell you something. It's it's even after you growing up, if I go for old, old white men and there's just... Enough, old, girl. There's enough girl giving you good work with enhancements. Hey, trust it's me. It's not the real thing. Man's giving you some AI hoods. It's not the real thing. Yeah. Man, it's blood. It's 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 hey, man's got to check it. It's exactly that. Man have got weave on their willy. And then, some AI sex. <laughs> Uh, AI. Man, man got, got the best version. <laughs> hey, you see me? <laughs> nah. No, the girl in my office don't ask, man, if it's natural or fake. Yeah, 100. <laughs> like, yo, is your lips real? Man, what? Hey, no. Is your no. thing real? You know, like a girl might, a girl, you know, like, imagine if you were blowing out a girl's back and she bent over and just looked at you and said, what, is this natural or fake? <laughs> <laughs> and you had to tell the truth. <laughs> And if you say fake, she just, if you say fake, she just says, hey, what? I ain't even on this, you know? No, I'm coming for the natural thing. I like, I like the real thing. I yeah, like the real thing. I like the real thing. Trust me. No, it's real. Because the other way when she's like, where's your pills? <laughs> now, you see, if a girl is telling you, you yeah, need take pills. Tablets. Yeah. <laughs> take tablets to get in this pum pum. Hey, hey, you have to take tablets. She don't care for you, my G. Yeah? Can you see when I was growing up? Viagra was for old men, especially old white men. Yeah? Now, you see, now, man, healthy bodied man are fucking up their soul with this Viagra, thing. Viagra, come on, bro. This, this man here. Yeah. Don't worry, no, 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 you are. You're behind the camera. So Trust me. Just make sure you don't say nothing loud so anyone can recognize your voice. Do you understand? But yes. girls, when you're getting it and you know it's I good and it might be going on for I a little bit longer I than I usual, I I ask the question. I I is this not true? Man ain't no Camagra killer. Yeah, Man's yeah. real life yeah, killers. Yeah, yeah. Just and ask the question. Not like them little boy that need Camagra to murder up the place. Yeah, yeah, I yeah, come yeah, in yeah. there straight face. Unjust. Sober. Unjust. <laughs> And it's happening. You don't drink two magnums and a... And a oh, so you're doing magnums, magnums on top as well? You, not, you don't go and link a team with an energy. No, no magnum. brother. Don't drink magnum. Like Does magnum work? Does so magnum work? No, man. Magnum don't work, I like it. Juice, that, they, they're everyone's front in anything. You know you're acting like you don't have a brain. They're just drunk and people. You go home and you go home and you go home and you go home and you get burst and you go home and you cut your team after being... Brother, that's natural. Yeah. But you no, see, that's no, why no. cheating is on the rise. Yeah. But you know what? Y'all are getting man. Y'all's got man at home that are idle. They're going out and getting. They're going out and getting AI. Yeah. It's just a computer. I'm a computer. I'm a machine, and I go until I can't go no more. You see that for me? Until my heart says stop. Until my heart says. Enough, see enough. Oh, yeah, now you no. see that? That's crazy. crazy. That's cheating. 
Man have to play on t- playing level field. <laughs> because if you was in small, you get kicked yeah. out. Hey, so let me ask you something. Yeah. You have to answer in a different ways. Without the Kamal, without the Kamal, bro. Yeah, your Kamal, bro. How you doing? How many? How many times can you have sex in a day without that? Brother, I've done it once. It's not like something I'm just saying to you. I can tell you the difference. Brother, I know a crew of man but which, which man, you're, what, man which man you're connected to. <laughs> that do this every day. <laughs> <laughs> just saying. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> what? <laughs> man jinking it. Man's what? jinking it, no, man's popping pill. You, I, what, you, so what, see like he did one, did you just buy it? One? Yeah, so I, I, cause I was telling him like, wait, 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 wait. Did like, it work? And I'm saying, bro, that's why when you said, I said, maybe if I had a car, it definitely is a bad thing. And you thing. haven't, so it worked, it made you do a mad thing and you it haven't made me want to buy it. Listen, now you see the beans that you used it on, is she still in your life now? Yeah. It's, oh shit, she's still around. Da, 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 da. So that's the girl keeper. Da, da. You say you're back from which <laughs> part? <laughs> <laughs> but hey, what, what you don't get here, yeah. it's, not, it's not even a bad Do you get headaches in the morning? Uh, Do you get what, heartache? Like no, nah, you know what? You know what? Hey, what? I'll give you that hey, what? kind of, hey, what? Kind of You see, because I'm a realist. You see, because I'm a realist. I'm only on front end, like I never went through a face. You know what, girls? If you if you was linking me in two fourteen, <laughs> I won't be in that trip. <laughs> no, I'm gonna keep it real. I'm gonna keep it real. Definitely the first time we linked. If you link me, I'd say like summer two fourteen. Was that the breaker in summer two? Yeah, you know the first one. Like I'm winning you now today. Yeah, yeah, today yeah. you're mine. Mm. I'm nighting up, putting on my suit. And stepping out in my Camagra. We out. We you outside. Me? My blue suede. <laughs> <laughs> I went for a little phase, but it's, it, I'm only saying that because it's what because of what he said. You see the headache thing. It's a real thing. Uh, I can only man that do it regularly. I've, I've heard him say that. Now I want to know thing. this: What effects does it have on your body? Remember, because. You raising your odds should be the one most natural things. Mm. You wake up in the morning, you, you, do you get me? You see when your odds don't right raise, that's the first sign of your body as a man telling you something's wrong. It's yeah? It now you see if something's wrong with your body, yeah? And you got a limp odd, and this pill can make this odd non-limp. What effects is it doing to your body? The thing is, it doesn't work like that, innit? If Sorry? If your team's just not working, I don't know if... What are you worried about? That's why, that's why they're mean. Are you alright? That's what they mean. Man used to go and drop us with it. Remember, it used to be a doctor's team. Yeah, team. It's not, it's, it's, it's not working, it's not... Wait, all com- wait, wait, no, this is the Wait, stop. Like a hundred percent. Wait, all commander is... If it's not moving, it's not moving you, bro. Hey, Rob. Unless it might move you to 25%. Sorry, sorry. All sorry. All 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 commander is the jelly version of Viagra. That's all it is. I know what it is. Viagra were prescription tablets for impotent man. Okay. That's, that's what they were. Alright, cool. Okay. So, so two, even if it's raising you 25%, it's like driving in second gear. You're still driving. <laughs> yeah, you're you're going to get there eventually. Yeah. You're going to get there eventually. No, 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 no. We're going to reach soon. Soon. Soon, soon. Let's have that game, man, yeah. But we still have to reach. We still have to I have to go. Watch out. If you take a man that is there for an all at 17. All right, your patois is awful. We're in a business. Sounds like Mongolian. Sounds Mongolian. I know, I said, watch out, watch out. You sound proper half Chinese, isn't it? Yeah. I'm Chinese. But you take, you take that man from 80, 90% already, and you go, right, boom, I'm going to put this like now you rematch your car. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah, it's but engine banner. Really engine banner on remapping right. of cars. Right. Yeah, that's why you're Don't get it twisted. You have to change parts, you know? <laughs> so if you're not changing all the all the all the all the you you watch you and everything there, brother. You can't manage the thing, brother. Yeah? You can't have a too fast for wet make fire, you get me? Yeah, not fear me, can't manage the engineer. Yeah? 
That me I say. Well, you see them guys with them big party with them big collect. So that's basically what it is. Some crap. Come on, guys. A, a computer hooked up to your other than someone on a laptop like this. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh. Yo, mad thing. Bro, you see what the man will go through to give a girl a good fuck? It's mad. The man will risk their health. Now, back in the day, the man, where I'm from. The man was laughing. The man that was having a heart attack to give a girl a good fuck. <laughs> Andrew. Hey, that's how that's deep it is. Now, you see, when we were growing up, <laughs> when we were growing up, they used to tell us, say, yo, you see fish and them thing, they're hocker and them thing, they're billy back. Billy back. Billy back. You get me? Man, they fuck the billing back thing and just go and bill in front. Man, just bill in front. <laughs> Mad, yeah. Well, that's so I'm gonna make you know, as men, see when there's a certain battle, there's a certain battle that you won't, you won't ever win. Are you saying yeah, you you because should... there's a woman, a, a, a female, can there's certain females out here that can just take, 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 take. Or when you, or when you're touching the wall, she's telling you to go deeper. Yeah. deeper. You're at the back of her back. You have, imagine you're poking out of her back and she's telling you deeper. What are you talking about? What are you on about? Yeah. <laughs> Where? Where? Where you want me to go? Where you want me to go? Where you want me to go? Hey! Man's a way he's wasted there. She's in deep off. Babe, where? Where am I going? Where the fuck you want me to go? Why you forgot yeah. to kill you? Now there's a certain type of women that will do that to a certain type of man. Maybe so you see that battle? I get man in security. Yeah, man has to know. I'm not looking at the house holding me shirt. <laughs> Because there's a time overnight oh. where a man's thing says, Yo, dada, I'm done enough. Yo, Yo pack up every blood. <laughs> yeah. Time for one. Yeah. And she's still at that boat. Can we go again? <laughs> hey, babe, my thing done. So there's a certain battle that the man must understand, say, mm. You get me? Not every battle, you know, but there's some battles out there. Hey, yeah? Wait, wait, one more thing. The last man in my mountain. Are you fixed they slam good when they're drunk? I threw them drunk, innit? <laughs> man, think them do everything good when them drunk. The Magnum thing comes in. It's in the yeah, that's what I'm saying. This is what I'm saying about the Magnum. But you know what? I'm even gonna lie, yeah? Someone recorded me having drunk sex, yeah? And when, I, when it was, while it was going on, I thought I was a gunman. You see, when I watched it back, <laughs> you realize you're a water man pistol man. Man's not a soldier, man's a cadet. <laughs> man ain't even got man's foot, man ain't even got a real gun. <laughs> a man won't take a man won't go on. Freeze. I remember smug guns. That was our <laughs> thing, you know. Things like that. Things have changed still, but yeah. now, Andre, the liquor will make you feel like you're doing a lot of things right. Look who I'm making right like, decisions. You see when I watched the video back, it didn't even look like I was beating up the pum pum. It didn't look like nothing. I was so ashamed. It's mad. Blood. You say you watch the normal you, one. You see, and you've been going on yeah, come on, come positions and head. Yeah, you get me. But the drunk thing, I thought I was doing it, but I really weren't. Right, yeah, yeah, I needed some. And you just heavy breathing <laughs> <laughs> in her face, and she just had to live a fuck ass. She just <laughs> want to <laughs> like turn me that way. <laughs> <laughs> It's real, you know. Yeah. It's real. Now, would a girl tell you that your mat, you're on top of a girl getting her hood? Yeah, she's in the middle of her thing, and your mat stinks. You think a girl's gonna tell you, "Hey, babe, stop"? Your mat stinks. You know, to your turn she head. just turned backwards. <laughs> yeah, or I just turn her head like this. And I know this. I watch this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You get me? So man, uh, man get yourself in position. See, when a girl just says, all right, babe, just take, take me from behind. That could be a, mean a lot of reasons. Donkey might be her favorite, but enough of it is that your mouth could stink or you're even ugly. She just don't want to look upon you. You're ugly, but you got good hood. But you got good hood. So just turn me back, please, innit? Everyone's happy. So I got. Hmm? You'll get, you'll get, forget their events. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Remember, we leave the same time, you know? <laughs> but me might reach before you. You understand me? Real talk, so nah, it's mad, it's mad, it's mad. Yo! One time I see a fella just with the 
Just like that. They're trying to finish before you finish. Now, some, some gal have dead their nerve ends in. Yeah, they're yeah, true. Dead their nerve ends yeah. with vibrators. Yeah. Just been out there rapid. 100. Pum Pum ain't got no feelings. 100. Or when, you, or, when you t- or when you touch it, she don't even know. Yeah. What are you doing? Yeah. What are you doing? Can't you feel that? What you doing? You didn't feel me slide in there? Ah, right, this is mad. I'm out of here. I'm not even trying to compete. I'm out yeah, of here. Yeah, you see that? That's a mad thing in our brother. That's an epidemic. Fun. That's a madness. No, this is a real, this is, this is real, real spill. Certain girls have rubbed out their thing so much, it's just sandpaper yeah, down there. They can't even feel nothing. There's no tread in it. No so you tread. know that when you try to screw, a screw into a, just a wall. <laughs> most, most of the thing unfreaded. It's <laughs> unfreaded, I think, brother. Trust me. No, girl, be careful though, man. Trust me. Be careful, because you don't want to rub out your thing. Mm. And then only your vibrator works. You got yeah. man banging you and you push him on the floor, get my vibrator. Uh, yeah, mad. You done that to yourself, Andrew, bitch. Andrew. How about that? Andrew. Then I had to go back out of the vibrator while you're beating. Nah, that's disrespect. Bully. Full that's disrespect. The little thing is you can't oh, say that. Oh, the bullet? Yeah, the little bullet. Yeah. Nah, that's a, that's a, I don't know, I wouldn't say that's a disrespect, but I'm going to drag out one of her yeah. proper yeah. things. Imagine, like her band. Imagine, imagine. I'm dragging out her band while you're beating. Stroke, Mad. Imagine you're mid-stroke and she pushes you off and opens the drawer like, yo, I'm using this. <laughs> yeah. That's beef, you know. I might have to elbow drop her and come out the yard. Nah, that is beef still. I might have to give her the people's elbow and start jumping around the room and that. <laughs> oh, hold that. You got me. Hold that. The garden. Out of your heart. That's mad. Might as well just jump inside, isn't it? Nah, it's mad still. Pum Pum still ain't gonna feel it because she rubbed it out. It's like, no matter what you do to the Pum Pum, I could have got a chisel at it. She still don't feel that. 100. Trust mad me. still. Why do you think they're rubbing out themselves so much though? But, but a man ain't rubbing no, them out. Stop that. They just they just crab up. Yeah, but some of them are mad. Yeah. They just crab up and on. All when you left them still one no, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But so. certain gal, certain gal, yeah, have a different way of thinking and a different. You gotta realize this could be a gal that that you like fucking, you know, mm. but you can't chill with her. Mm. Yeah, so you prefer just not to chill with her and go and chill with the one that Facts. you like to chill with. Now you Facts. see her. See if ten men feel the same way about her. Vibrate is her best friend. You ain't got to go far for it. Amazon, Prime, dropped at your door next day. Babe, here's your vibrator. Hold that. Do you get me? Because yeah, I remember when I remember when vibrators were taboo. Taboo. Well, they were taboo. The, just masturbating in general by all females. Yeah, but this is... taboo to even have that conversation and the, the amount of sex that you see on online from... The soft porn on Brother, the let me tell you something. There's no such thing as soft porn now. You see, if you have a child, no we, used to have, we used to porn. have watershed. You see, if your child stays up late, he might not can sleep. He <laughs> might have had a daytime nap. You yeah, at yeah. no, nah, but you see nowadays, he might have a daytime nap. We had to go to the shop and look at the top shelf. That's where the, 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 the things was. See your child, he might have napped in the daytime and can't nap at night. Or he might have a cold or he just can't sleep. You see if he's left in the wrong room with the wrong thing on, with the remote, he just getting up naked attraction. <laughs> that starts at nine o'clock. There's bodies everywhere. Yeah, it's, yeah. Yeah. it's nuts. Aye, I'm saying, aye, no, no I, 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 babe station, wrong. Aye, babe station is a channel. Are you still going there? Yeah. I see when I was away on my, see when I was on my babe holiday. Probably not the biggest one see now. when I was on my holiday, there was a 10 minute review. You see in that 10 minutes, he used to make stuff happen. Yeah, there was a 10 minute free gap. Like, hi, we're starting in 10 minutes. This is what we got going on for the night. See, when I'm on holiday, when I was on my holiday, when I was a picnic, man used to use that. That was man's vice. Hey. <laughs> you know the, the 10 minute advert? <laughs> Don't get it twisted. Those days are done. <laughs> yeah, it tastes different. They, they look at the lingerie pages in the Freeman's magazine. Course, that, man, did that. They see through shit. Course, man, did that. That's how you know man was fucked up children. <laughs> man was sitting in the yard pre catalogs, pre in the Freeman's. <laughs> no, I, I, is that what you're talking about? I, no, I've but, done that before, still. I, I'm not going to lie. Like, I'm, I'm not going to lie to you. The man who was fucked up. My catalog was Little Woods, though. Hey, little My one was the Little Woods catalog. Like, no, like, let me see what I don't what... Yo! Hey! Yo! Hey! Mama! No, I, I mean, said, Daddy, where you do? Just see the little ones. Hey! 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 Hey!
listen, how old were you when you were doing that? Because that weren't secondary school times. Nah, no, but they say that a child just tries to discover their body from a very young age, innit? Because remember, you're a little boy, you know, and the first thing one day, you just remember, you discover your hands. You see when a baby discovers their hand, like, oh, this my hand is connected to me. And then he starts, goes a little yeah, bit old, like, yeah, oh, yeah, this yeah, shit yeah, is yeah, connected yeah, yeah. to me. You start, it's natural. Yeah. Do you get me? So, I right, let me ask every man this now, yeah? If it, does every man in this is mad? How do I ask this question without being alright? Don't, don't, don't. I don't. No. I can't. No. No wise. <laughs> no wise. Yeah. No wise. I just played it over in my head, and it was a big why. So we got a like, pause. We got a pause. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> anyway, talking about wise, yeah, we got a touch on a a, a a situation which I think is nuts. Yeah. Yeah. You're talking about big the thing. boy, big uh, big Phil, liquor Phil, liquor Phil. Yeah. And him nasty brother. Hey. Yeah. yeah Phil is you, know you gotta realize, yeah. This is this is what I'm saying. I'm a big man now, yeah. Brother, they had that brother on kids TV when I was a child. Mm-hmm. So if you see if he he, he never just grew that the the, the, the attraction to, to little boys. Mm-mm. He's been doing this for years, bro. Is it, right? Coming like it's a family business. In better involved, <laughs> and he wants to try and look off his brother. This way, you always know. You see, um, accountability. We've been talking about this a lot, baby. See, pointing the finger, accountability. Sometimes you got to take it on for yourself. So you see, when they realize they bagged his brother, he start talking about I ain't got a brother no more. Mm. Not realizing that these things soon come. Yeah, because I heard, I heard Holly, I heard Holly, Holly won't work with him. Holly knew, Holly yeah, Holly saying there what? Holly refuses to work with him, innit? That's yeah, what, that's why, that's why this morning I had to get yeah, rid of him. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Boy, you see what? But you know what, bro? I'm always kind of twisted, yeah, Bugs, yeah. I must bro. say this. You see, when he left his woman for a man, everyone come out and said, ah. Oh, He's a hero. You're, you're so hero. brave. It must have been so hard. hard for you. To leave your woman for a man. I don't want to talk about this because the things that nearly just slip out of my mouth. Yeah. This is bare strike. And everyone, and everyone, and everyone was, they had his back. Now look, not just have you left your woman for a man. Yeah. Because the poor woman, no one cared about her. No. No one gave a shit no. about that woman. No one went and spoke to her like, how are you feeling? How do you feel? How do you, you never feel? You yeah. never interviewed her. Are you sure you weren't what? preening your brothers? Understand. Yeah. You know, like that. How are you feeling? Family events, was he si- Where was he sitting? Did he sit next to your dad? Did he sit next to your dad and all your the uncle. time? Yeah. And your uncle. You understand? Man used to roll. So no one gave a fuck about her. Remember he was talk- a hero. Mm-hmm. Yeah? Fuck. Now look, there's something Oli Willoughby knows and, and, and has known. Yeah, remember, since the TV business, you gotta act like you don't know some shit. Yeah? yeah? But there's only so long she could keep that fucking shit up for. Do you understand me? Then she just come out at us. Ew, I'm not working with this brother no more. He's a fucking, he's a bacon. Yeah? It's uh, mad. Do you get it? No, you see what I'm saying? You see why, you see why to me, yeah? It's so mad, yeah? Because, like, as a you, man grew up with Phil Scho- Philip Schofield. I'm Rolf. Ro- blood. I do not listen. And you see when he died the other day? They just put on the thing, yo, rapist dead. Is basically. he dead? <laughs> Him died last week. I never know. Yeah. Nasty, dirty blood clot, basically, is what the papers <laughs> said. Dead. Imagine the name's the champion Rolf. Champion. It's, remember, it's Rolf's car. Yeah. Yeah. You can go in the day. <laughs> Rolf's car. Hey, that was mad. Man of going like that was mad. Remember the name? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Remember it. You can go in today. <laughs> but we're just glad that we was watching it on that side of telly. Telly. See, anytime they were selling in for a live audience, me glad my parents they never put me in a competition. Hey, no, I no, no, yeah. remember. I love my mother. Aye, 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 uh, Wait there, do you remember when you couldn't understand why your mum wouldn't let you go to certain right. people's house? 100! Uh, do you remember? Right. And you used, be, used to always be mad at your mum like, oh, I, I wish I could beat you up. Yeah. <laughs> I can't. I, I, I did it to my school, like, my mum wouldn't let me go and repeat it. Like, my mum, they tried it, my mum was still mad. Your mum was saving your bum hole. C- BBC! Yeah. <laughs> your mum was saving Aye. your butt. Hey, <laughs> black bum hole corruptors at the BBC, <laughs> they were trying to catch you. And corrupt you. You have to be careful. Yeah, they got you up with We don't even chat. Not my, my mom protected me. From yeah, my mom protected me still. So you see one of these shows. You know when you go home. I remember when I stay at my friend's house. No. Yeah, I do. <laughs> no. I'm protecting your ass. Hundred <laughs> percent. 
Because there's enough broken kids, you know. Yeah. And right now, all they're gonna do is get a little you that's got his thing dug out by them and a little change, yeah. But he's still gonna have those memories. So it's not something you get me. So I thank my mother. Thank you, mum. Thank I you for them, not emptying me to no money. competition. Man, in fact, their money. Yeah? Because yeah. uh, things will be like different. you don't know what could have happened. Yeah. Your, your hope, your hope, you might be wearing flowers and stuff. It all could have been different. 100. Your mum your mom kept you grounded. Yeah? You see me? So My joke. Thank and I thank you for keeping me healthy and I thank God for making me not end up in that same hospital that them nasty pussy old used to work in. Huh? Man like Savile and that. Man used to be going to the hospital. Go into the, go into the sick the children. And go into the ward where the pity them can't talk properly. Yeah? Don't. And can't really move. Don't. So the man's grabbing the youth. That's <laughs> <laughs> a um, mad thing. The man's grabbing the youth and the youth can't see. Nah, it's mad. Yeah, like, man, I'm trying to point his eyes. Don't worry about him. He does this all he's the time. Happy, he's just happy to see you. <laughs> <laughs> right. He's, he's sick, sick man. Blood. Like, man, man, I take it. Look, it's not a joke, innit? Like, and they don't highlight it enough. So it's still, when you check it, it's still kind of brushed under the carpet, you know? Yeah? Because you see my man's Philip Schofield's brother. He it's should have, well, that was even brushed under the carpet. You see what? Yeah, that wasn't as big as it should have been. I believe this thing works. Like, there's a couple, there's a few good people in the system, innit? And you see when they know that the good people have got hold of it to let it out. They gotta start severing all ties and and maintaining their image, innit? Hundred. You get it. So even Phil Schofield, I reckon everybody knew for how long. This, hundred. This ain't no this ain't no new surprise. For hundred. Me. Hundred. But now it's out in the public. Everyone's like, yo, you can't talk to me. Yo, 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 yeah, yeah. Hundred. Hundred. Remember, you see the elites. The elite are a set of people that only are full of elites. You see, in the elite world, there's things that happen in that world only they know about. Yeah. Now I give you, I give you an example. Someone I know the other day went on a date with someone famous. Yeah, they didn't even go on a date. They just had a link. You know the first thing this brother done, made that, made her sign an NDA. Yeah, sign this before you even come and chat to me. Enough NDAs. How do you think? Why do, why do you think NDAs were created? Exist. Why do yeah? they exist? NDAs are what created are like a man could cheat on his wife. And as and it's and sign NDA and, and it's like if the girl if the girl try to my wife you have to pay you have to pay. Why do you think these things are created, bro? Sick. Mm. So there's enough things like yo, you might see me touch up a couple of little cool youth share, but hey, what, but hey, what, sign that NDA. Yeah, you sign that before. Whatever you, you see no, here, a stays even, here. A man's not even telling you what you're gonna see. A man's just saying, look, we're rolling tonight. You're gonna have fun. Sign this NDA. Yeah, it don't matter. Just fun, fun. It's all fun. Mad. I just want you to, because you can't expose where I go in the hangouts yeah, that, yeah, I, that yeah, I'm in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just, yeah. just fun. Sign this. And then when you sign it now, a man's got you. So 100. You know, I, can, I can do anything in front of you. 100 percent Trust me. Mental. This yeah? Blood. And even this shoot now, even my man's brother, 12 years in jail, he ain't gonna do the full 12 years. How the fuck? Are you getting this man that's gonna ruin someone else's life? Forever. Hurt people, hurt people. Yeah? This child's never gonna be able to sleep it off. Yeah? It's not one of them. Yeah, you understand? You see the, you see and you give him 12 years. You see the ripple effect? You see the ripple effect of somebody, of a, of a big man touching up a. I can, I can only imagine it. What are you saying? Like, life is the only You see the ripple. The, it's the only sentence. Listen, listen, you see the ripple effect. So imagine, all right, cool. I'm, I'm, this, is, this is what I imagine in my head. I'm not saying that it's facts, but let's say this. So it starts with the initial event. So the uncle, the dad, whatever, touches the young boy. The young boy feels a way about it. Now, imagine it's going on for a little while. He start, he becomes um, desensitized to it. So when he goes into the world now, he starts, he starts off things. Yeah, and then blaming it on He's, that. He starts off things. So how far does that does that one ripple it? spread? It like? spreads. How far does it spread? It spreads. Because, well, you think about Philip and his brother. What are you saying? His dad must have been involved in the same thing, or is that? No, no, I reckon it's a family you know business. What? You know what? Let me give let me give you a joke, right? I'm, it's not even a joke. I'm talking. I'm saying that. Yeah. All right. Cool. When I lived in Crofton, yeah, there was a family. There was a um, there was a it was a mixed race family. There was a black woman and a white man, and they had three or four kids um two girls and two boys or something like that anyway now i used to, now as a youth man always thought they was weird 
Like, you know, like, as a youth just growing up, like, man's riding their mountain bike, mm. weirdos, mm. stopping outside that yard, mm. mad, mm. boom. So then, the youth, now the next youth, one of their youths, I, one of the, I'm not going to say his name, Andrew, man, you're a nonce, man, I'm saying your name. Boom. Did that come out recently? A little while ago, okay. he, he, used to, he, used to, he used to actually roll with us as kids, when we used to ride mountain bike and that, but there was something weird about this youth. So then, I think a couple years later, it come out that his dad was a nonce. So, like, a man's like, yeah, that explains it. Like, this is where the weirdness is from. Like, boom, bam, yeah, that's it. So, that's come out, his dad's got nicked, whatever, whatever, blah, 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 blah. His, man, his dad's gone. Um, about 10, 10, 15 years after, Andrew's a nonce. He got on the bus, he got on the bus in Brooklyn, was feeling up a little school girl. Yes, I know, dirty boy, Andrew. Andrew's a nonce. Mm. Now, I'm not, trying, I'm not making no excuses for it, you know, because there's none. You get what I'm saying? Just because just cause a man stabbed you don't mean you can't stab somebody else. But at the same time, there's got to be a correlation to it to, mm. to make it right in a man's head. 100. Because it, it, like, you, there's something wrong for that to not register as wrong. Mm -hmm. Do you understand what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, it's mad. And I've, I grew up with this kid. And I never knew, like, now, I, I, if I see him, what am I supposed to do? If you even look back though, most of those conversations stem from the fact that in black families, th those those conversations were taboo, right? So there's your husband's got how much baby mothers and how much outside kids. It's a conversation that don't get had. Mental health back then, it was just a bad you or you're just too fast and there was no conversation about mm -hmm. it. Do you get what I mean? Even equally now to even talk about Kamagra or a man yamin pum pum or these are all conversations within our community that are you can have today, but you couldn't have back then. So have with who? You, you wanna talk about that? <laughs> no. What are you talking about? <laughs> I want to bomb my cloud, you talk to road boy. Now come round here with them fuck, you know. When I dip on that. Yeah, when I dip on the irritating thing. When I dip on, on that, you know. The ear pan teeth, when I dip on that. <laughs> nah, real talk, though. Stop, I speaking have... Stop speaking Mongolian. <laughs> nah, it's real. It's real. It's real. Saying. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. It's real. It's real. It's real, though. Yeah, because everybody does everything now, anyway. Yeah. Like, get, like, teenage girls are having tensums and. All these types of shit and every girl, all girls, girl, girl has never had cocky, but she's a lesbian. Mm. You don't even know if you like it. And she don't like man. How? How do you know? Mad. You, how do you know? Just hate, isn't it? And it's just you've been taught to hate before you can mm. learn to love. You know what I mean? Yeah, you know what it is. You know what we've this puts down. We we put this down to. You see, the shaping of you of a certain age will carry you through life. Yeah, you see the certain things you've seen, witnessed, gone through, will, sh has, will shape your future, yeah? And it's a real thing. Because yep. if you start seeing everything, if it's right to you back then, or you grown up knowing it's right, like, you see a family I know, they have a thing where they call it a sea of forgetfulness. Mm -hmm. So that means that they, God, they believe God has allowed them to, when they do wrong things, throw it in the sea of forgetfulness. I'm saying that's dangerous. <laughs> that's a really dangerous thing for your parents to teach you.